So now one of the things is what what can we? I mean, you know, when I look at the community and and the, the one of the power base, like right now, you know, <clears throat> with what we're doing uh, on the radio and we're talking about issues and getting it out there and things like that. What role does black media plays, you know, whether it's newspapers, social media, uh, 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 radio shows, TV, uh, does black media, what role should it be playing in the issues that we're dealing with in power in our community? Well, Bishop, I first want to thank you for having me. Uh, I would do you. anything I can to ever be there for you when you call, thank even you. if it's last minute. <laughs> thank you. I was at church this morning at Bethel Baptist Church preaching. I just came from there. Sound like you. I yeah. can hear it in your it's, voice. It's in my voice, yeah. <laughs> Uh, but um, um, so we were doing ministry there this morning. But black media, uh, in this question you pose about black media and minority media mm -hmm. in general, I think mm -hmm. there's a lot of uh, Latino and black outlets mm -hmm. in media. I think it is the job of minority communities mm -hmm. to broadcast their communities. Amen. And I think black media per se, we have uh, two black papers here in the city, mm -hmm. the Monitor, which I'm the editor at large of, Good. and the uh, San Diego Voice and Viewpoint. Mm -hmm. I think that it is the job of the Voice and Viewpoint mm -hmm. and the Monitor right. to broadcast, no matter, bipartisan, mm -hmm. what is going on in the black community. Right. Right. It is. It should be your first priority. Right. If you're deemed as black media, mm -hmm. you should have a priority of right. Of broadcasting those things, right? And I think that the role of black media mm -hmm. is to broadcast their community first, right? Then go to the outskirts, but right. do your community first. Tell the people about the positive things happening in the community. Right. Tell the people about the work that you're doing with cast and right. with gang uh, uh, intervention. Right. Tell the people about the cases and the causes that Nan fights for. Right. Tell the people about what the NAACP is doing. But if you just don't do that and you start playing politics, yeah, and you start going skipping your people mm -hmm. to go other places right. before taking care of your own. Right. Uh you you are not doing the job of a black media outlet. Right. And it's the job of any black media outlet and Latino media mm -hmm. outlet to broadcast their community first. Right. Exactly. And get the word out about what's happened, what's going on, because a lot of times people don't even know what's going on. I mean that's like with man, we're doing a lot of good and great things in the community. Like you said with cats, we're doing a lot of great things in the community and people need to know about these things and hear about these things. Right. But for what so why do you think we have that issue, you know, as far as in the media, especially people of color and black media, Latino, I I I like to say people of color, you know, why what can we do to get them? But let me just say, well, what can we do to get these media folks to really report the story right, rather than having? Because it seems like you know, what media? What have, media folks have have? When talk about black media, whether okay. it's uh, there's this thing <clears throat> that I see on the internet sometimes. Yep. Where it, it, it seems a lot of times, like the, the especially the black media, a lot of these sites. They follow what mainstream media does. I mean, they're not yeah. reporting anything until the mainstream media reports it. Yep. Then they report it. Yep. But there's a lot of stuff that's going unreported that's happening in our communities that's not being reported. But the problem we have with black media, again, and this is not all black media, mm -hmm. I'll say particularly about our city. Right. We have two black media outlets. Mm -hmm. The papers I just told you about. Uh -huh. you, you got to get out in the community right. to broadcast the community. Right. And the problem we have with black media, again, mm -hmm. you got jealousy. You got haters in the media mm -hmm. who don't want to broadcast what's going on. Right. And that's why other media, white media, other media picks it up. Mm -hmm. And don't get mad when we get out on other media and get our message out. I, you know, thing with me, you know, they, uh, I was in the voice of your point when I first started pastoring uh -huh. all the time. Uh -huh. And, you know, they stopped broadcasting me. Why? You know, after well, when we were through the penal code case, uh -huh. uh, they stopped putting me on. You know, I don't know why. But, you know, uh, I was blessed to have another paper pick me up. Mm -hmm. But... Uh, there's no reason. The noise. The there's, going on. there's no, there's no reason why in the world, black media and minority media should not broadcast their own. Right. And if you're not, if you're not in the community, you don't know what's going on. Right. You need to listen to the advisors in your community who right. can tell you what's going on from every angle. Right. And uh, you know, I, if you don't call me and you got a black paper, mm -hmm. that's your problem. Right. Not right. my problem. Right. I call you. We send press releases. Mm -hmm. You don't come out to our stuff. Mm -hmm. You don't come out. You don't call and find out. Mm -hmm. You don't get the information. Right. That's why we have black media following white media because black 
uh, some black media and mm -hmm. some Latino media mm -hmm. has not learned to follow their community first. Right. They right. want to follow other things first and then want to get mad when we find other ways to get our message out. Exactly. Especially especially like when you get a good story out there and, and uh, yep. mainstream media takes it on yep. and it really catch fire. Right. They're like, well, why you didn't come to us? Right. Why you didn't come to us? <laughs> well, when we do come, you got the press release. You don't print our stories. Yeah. yeah. And, you know? and you got the press release. You <laughs> exactly. Know? exactly. I, know, I know, you know, one thing about me, Bishop, I know who gets our press releases when National Action exactly. Network. Exactly. Because we use MailChimp <laughs> and we can see who viewed the email three, four times. Wow. So, you know, problem we got with Voice and Viewpoint and others uh -huh. uh, is they, they you, you can't have a paper. You right. can't have a media outlet and not be in the community. That's right. And if you ain't got no journalist, you got journalists like you mm -hmm. and me mm -hmm. who can tell you what's going on. Exactly. From our exactly. angle. Exactly. You want us to write it? We'll write it for so you. So don't get mad when we get out. That's right. And get our message out another way, then you mad because other media got the story that you didn't get. Exactly, exactly. So you got to be there, and and you know one of the things that I hear a lot of times is being short of staff. You know, right. Or where we're short of staffing, and we can't really uh, get out there and do all these different things. So what would you say to that? That's an excuse. Okay. That's an excuse. Mm -hmm. You can get out and do. The problem with us, we're so busy talking about what we can't do, <laughs> we don't talk about what we can do. Right. I just talked about the blessing and partnership this mm -hmm. morning. Mm -hmm. you, you got people who don't want to partner. Right. They, they talk about, we ain't got enough journalists. We ain't got this. We ain't got that. They talk about that because they're making excuses mm -hmm. for what they don't want to do. Right. You have Bishop Bowser. You have Ricky Laster. You have all kinds of people in the community mm -hmm. who can give you their source of information. That's right. National Action Network, we have our source. Yeah. You, you, it's your job to reach out to us. Mm -hmm. We send you press releases. Yeah. All you have to do is call us story. and find out what's happening. Yeah, yeah, so. exactly. We're giving you a story, that's for sure, and so on. So, uh, uh, for this brief, we got to get you back, man. Yep. We got to get you back because we we got we got some hot stuff we got to talk about. We do. And a lot of folks are afraid to yep. talk like you are, and like I do, you yep. know. And we get the flack for speaking out, but you know, I think the community needs to hear, needs to know this, and 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 we need to be more engaging to challenge our community to step up. Yep. You know, we can no longer go for this. You know, you just do whatever you want to do and give, you get a pass on it. And Bishop, let know. me say this about media and then we got to close, I know. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. it's so important for the people to hear this. Mm -hmm. if, 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 if black media won't broadcast you, find other ways to get your message. That's right. That's and one right. thing that I've done and I've learned how to do, and Reverend Sharpton has done it too, you, you, you can't wait for people. Mm -hmm. You got to right. do what God calls you to do mm -hmm. and let them cop follow you. Mm -hmm. and, that, and that's what's going to happen. And so that's what I've found that uh, works for, for me, and I hope that other people will catch on to it, is that find a way to build relationships in the white media and in the terrestrial media, radios and others, and find your own relationships, and then they'll broadcast your story right. That's right. Because they, right. they know you, and you know them. That's right. Thanks. All right, so we're going to go ahead and close out. We're going over time, and uh, thank you for tuning in. Tune back in next week. Thank you. 9 o'clock a.m. on kblkradio.com, and thank you for tuning in. God bless you.